frogs are amphibians. Cold-blooded animals cannot produce their own heat, so they obtain it from their surroundings. Amphibians are vertebrates, which means they have a spinal cord. These animals are able to breathe through their thin, moist skin. Amphibians are animals that can walk on land and swim in water. Frogs can jump high so they can walk on land and they have webbed feet so they can swim faster. A frog has a life cycle. The process in which a tadpole turns into a frog is called metamorphosis. A mother frog lays about 4,000 eggs in water. These eggs are jelly-like and are very soft. The tiny larvae hatch and swim around to find plants to feed on. These tadpoles still have gills, so they can't leave the water. In time, the tadpoles start to grow legs. Firstly, the hind legs appear, then the lungs begin to develop, and finally, the front legs appear. The tadpoles start to look more like frogs and are now known as froglets. While the froglets become more adventurous, but as a result, many of them are eaten by large fish and water insects. After some months, the froglet slugs are fully developed, so they can now get out of water and breathe. Their tails will shrink away and vanish. Adult amphibians return to the water to lay eggs. Amphibians reproduce by external fertilization, where the male deposits the sperm on the eggs outside the female body. Amphibians are carnivores, which means they eat meat. In fact, frogs eat insects and small worms. We can also call them insectivores. There are about 8,000 known species of amphibians, of which 90% are frogs. But there are more animals in this group, such as toads, 
newts and salamanders. All these amphibians live in fresh water, such as ponds and lakes, where the water is not moving a lot. There are no amphibians in salt water.